Thank you. Hey, this afternoon, Capital Metro is expected to deliver a formal answer about that scathing state report on the agency's finances and safety. Yeah, last month, the state Sunset Commission said Capital Metro needed a major overhaul in those areas. Continuing our coverage now through this review process for the transit agency, our Matt Fleener live in the studio with more on this. Hi there, Sally and Chris. That response expected this afternoon from Capital Metro. They expect to go line by line through each of the recommendations. A seven-month review of the agency says Capital Metro burned through $200 million in reserves on new buses and buildings, but had no formal plan to do so. The report says payments for rail projects were approved in many different parts of the agency. That's part of the reason why the cost for rail ballooned from an original $60 million to $140 million. The Sunset Report was required by state law passed in the last legislative session sponsored by State Representative Eddie Rodriguez and Kirk Watson. The commission says Capital Metro could do more to save more than $60 million over the next five years if it follows some of those recommendations, which include making management changes and contracting out some of its services. Last month, this is what Capital Metro's board president said about those changes. This board expects this community to hold us accountable mm -hmm. and, and to make sure that we're out there earning the commitment and trust from our community. As we said, this report is expected this afternoon. We'll have more for you tonight on KXAN Austin News at 5. In the studio, Matt Fleener, KXAN Austin News.